All right, everybody. Hello, and welcome back to another video with Token Tim 420. This is a medical marijuana review for those over the age of 18. All right, guys, you know what to do. If you haven't subscribed, hit that button down there. It makes me happy. Um, leave me a thumbs up, thumbs down. Let me know how you're feeling tonight. And show me a comment down there. Let me know what you're up to, what you're smoking on, how you like the video or didn't like the video. All right, we're going to throw a twofer in here and try to get caught up. This is the uh, Monthly Vibes Junior Box for February. We're a little bit late. Sorry about that. And then we got a Wish Haul. Everything from Wish is under $3. It's all 420 stuff. Um, so it's just a cheap little haul to see what their stuff's like. Also wanted to... We get these from the kids. They come from the FYE store at the mall. This one's... Uh, um, it's all Japanese noodles. It even come with a squishy. Um, these are fun to get if you have a get together with a couple stoner friends um, and you want to do something fun. These things are real fun. They got the munchy packs there too. These are the ones we really like. Um, the noodle one was a new one we just tried this time. Um, the reason I wanted to show you guys these they got slaps lollipops. You guys know what slaps they call those stickers. That's a big old fruit slap thing slapped on a stick. Isn't that weird looking? But you get um, snacks from around the world. You know, some stuff you already know, Sour Patch Kids. Um, barbecue Crunchies. You also always get a drink in there. And these drinks are real cool. They got a um, a ball in the top. You got to smash it down, then it ends up right here to drink out of it. So they're kind of cool. And you get all different kinds of stuff in there. Some of it tastes good. Um, some of it doesn't. So that's why it's fun to do. I like to do it with the kids. I don't eat the crap. I just feed it to them. Um, I like to see the looks on their faces. Some of you guys know we went to the mall the other night, and I was a little bit... Too medicated when we went, maybe. Um, so we got a couple extra ones of these. This is like a Hello Kitty one. It's got all different kinds of cookies. and It's a Hello Sanrio or something like that. Little cupcakes. And it comes with two drinks in this one. And, um, also wanted to show these. Slow Burning Jay said he likes stuff. His uh, wife is Filipino, I think. Um... These are Asian. If you're willing to try these on film so we can see the look on your face, I will send you a box of these, Slow Burning Jay. Um, nobody in my house liked them. <laughs> but I will pick you up a brand new box just so we can see your face on the... What do you think it tastes like? So let me know. Send me something on the video, Jay. Or on Instagram. And I'll mail you one out. Alright, so let's get to this unboxing. First of all, let's get to this joint, man. That's three minutes in. We ain't lit a joint. What the hell? Hmm. Just some of that uh, layer cake from Cure Leaf. I'll probably have a review on this tomorrow. I did pick up some more flour the other day. I haven't opened yet. I'm going to do it on film so you guys can see it too. Um... That way you can see how much was actually in there. You know I like to do that. So I want to open it, so we'll have to do a review. We did pick up a shatter and a crumble today with True Leaf Cell. Also, um, Grow Healthy is having a sale right now on their um, vapes and distillates and stuff like that. It's 35% off right now. So it's a real good deal on that. There's the box. You get bubble wrap. That's good for the kids to play with. Um, this is the Valentine's box, so we got some hearts. <coughs> Sticker. More stickers. You guys know what those do. They stick on shit. <coughs> Two glass pieces there. Let's get all this stuff out of the box real quick, and we'll just... Toss the box and the paper to the side. 
All right, so you're going to get a Juicy J in there. Uh, hemp wrap. These are strawberry fields. I don't think I've tried the strawberry fields yet. Some Bob Marley papers. Uh, pure hemp. They've also been doing the um, glass tips in the last couple of their boxes, which you guys know I really dig the glass tips. And you're always going to get your clipper lighter. Well, that's a cool little picture on that one. Um, and you guys can use code TOKEN10 for 10% off of this. It's not an affiliate code. I don't make nothing off of that. It's just for you guys. What does it say? Oh, eat me. A little mushroom from, I guess, Alice in Wonderland. Um, Hempwick. And then you get two pieces in the... Um, you get two glass pieces in all the monthly vibe boxes. That's one thing I like about them. They're not short and young glass. Oh, it's a cute one. It's a little shorty. Not real long. Um, nice blue color, so I dig that color. Nice. And this is one that should pop a little better when you're smoking. It's kind of like a little rope pattern in there. I like that. Um, like I was saying, you're going to get a, um, two pieces in every one of their boxes. If you get the bigger box, you're still going to get a hand pipe or a bubbler and a big piece. The little box, you're going to get a bubbler and a hand pipe. Ooh, digging the colors on this one, too. Check that out. That's a sexy little bubbler. I think that's the big, it's a little different than, a little bigger than that one. A little different style than that one there. It kind of comes back a little bit more. Kind of digging on that one. Make sure it ain't got no. Yep, no holes in her. So there's what you get right there. I believe they raised the price of the box slightly to 19 bucks but they knocked the shipping down so in the long run um they knocked the shipping down to $1.99 which it was up to like seven eight bucks um but they did raise the box like three dollars um but with the 10 percent off you're getting a 10 percent off the box price not the shipping anyway so that actually works out better for you guys you actually get a better deal on the box if that makes sense, hopefully it does. <laughs> like I said, the box when I got it, I think it was 16, so I think it ended up being like 22. Um, I did get a lot of boxes, so it's hard to keep track of sometimes. <laughs> but like I said, you guys can use the 10% off code, it'll save you. Uh, like I said, it does look like the box went up slightly, but the shipping come down, so it all equals out. It will be, you know, cheaper because you was only getting 10% off the $16. Now you're getting 10% off the uh, $19. So you're actually getting more of a discount. All right, let's get into our wish. Some of this stuff I opened already. If anybody of you guys have ever dealt with wish, they come in. Um, you order everything together, but it comes in all different times. Um. <clears throat> so I was trying to keep track. It doesn't really give you any kind of description on the package. So I wasn't really able to see, you know, judge what was in each one sometimes. So I had to open a couple of them to figure it out. Some of them I didn't. Some of them I could feel and kind of figure out what was in them. Um, but we'll get these open real quick. Like I said, nothing in here was over $3. Most everything was a dollar, to be honest. But it was a dollar for shipping also. So that means everything costs around $2 to be a piece to be shipped. We'll open the green one. I think you can see this one better. Let me get my cheat sheet out. Um, these was a dollar a piece with a dollar to ship. So it's a little grinder and storage all in one. I thought these was kind of cute. Um, not going to be the best grinder in the world or the best storage container, but I thought these would be cute for on the go. 
uh, maybe throw in your little bag or your box or whatever you guys use. So we got two of those, one for me to try out and one for a giveaway. Um, some stuff I got two of so I could try it out and do the giveaway. Some of the other stuff I just got one uh, either for a giveaway or just to try out. These little guys, the silicone pipes, was a dollar a piece. And again, a dollar to ship. Um, now, some of the stuff, like these silicone pipes, um, the only color I could get for a dollar was the red. If I tried any other color, they come up to two bucks or something like that. So they do come with some little metal screens, a little pack of those. It's got a little metal insert in the bowl, carved way down here on the bottom. But it's got a lid, so you could actually pack this and take it. And then it comes with a filter. Little filters you're sticking in. I guess you just have, once you use these two up, you just have to buy some more. So we got two of those. I'll either try one or just give them both away. Um, I haven't decided on this one yet. Use the silicone pipe. How bad can it be, right? Um, I'm kind of interested to see how good these things do. So we'll probably do a review on that one. Like I said, we did get two of them. And like I said, we just stuck with the red color on those. Um, now, I did get one thing that I probably shouldn't have. Um, they had raw papers on there. And it said it was a 64-pack. Um, it was two seventy-five with a dollar shipping, so three seventy-five. But it showed the whole big case. Now, I was kind of iffy. I'm like, I'm not really going to get a case for $3. I'm sure of that. I figured it was going to be an off-brand or something like that. Um, it ended up being just one pack. And I guess how they're doing it, let's see, because I knew there wasn't a 60-pack. There's 32 leaves in there and 32 tips. So that's the papers and the tips all in one. So I, like I said, I knew there wasn't a 60. I know there was coming hundreds and 30s and 50s, but I'd never seen a 60-pack of papers, so that's really kind of how they got me. Um, so that's the one thing that I, they probably really got on me on. Like I said, it's three bucks for a pack of papers, three seventy-five, which I could probably get that at the vape store for about the same price, if not a tiny bit cheaper. All right, then we got these here. These are strictly for a giveaway and to kind of just see the quality. They was weed socks. And it kind of looked like Cheech and Chong on there. You guys can see that. Not the best picture of them. And they're not bad quality socks either. They're pretty thick. I was afraid they'd be real thin. Um, these was also socks, socks, socks. was a dollar with a dollar shipping. So like I said, most everything was cheap, cheap. I think that's one of the more expensive items there. Uh, these was like $1.75. Now, I did get a discount, um, I think 10% off or something like that. If you go to the app, and usually at the front page of the app, there's a, at the top, there's a little banner that says, apply this code for 50% off. You never get 50% off, but you usually get around 10. Uh, these was little metal stash jars. But if you can see down there, they've got a lip inside or a seam. So any of your little stuff is going to get caught in between there and you're going to lose a little something, something. So I'll probably use these for roaches. Um, I don't know what you guys will use the one I give you away for. but So I did get two of them. They're aluminum. Both of them, I got them both in gold. And like I said, you couldn't see a real good picture, and I was afraid, um, you know, because I know how they do aluminum. It's usually rolled, and it leaves that crease down in the bottom where you'll get a lot of little pieces stuck down in there. Which, if you're smoking the same strain all the time and you don't care about losing a little bit, it's not going to be a big, real, big deal. But if you're like me and you switch strains all the time, it'll start to have the smell of the other ones after a while. 
Um, and these are the top puffs. These was a dollar a piece too. Now again, I think I had to get these in clear to get them for a dollar. I don't think I could get any other color um, and get them for a dollar. So what this is, it's the pipe and everything all in one. You're going to stick that in there like that. <coughs> and then you screw that onto a water bottle, anything, and you got your own little bong. We will test these out in another video. You guys know I am anal and have to clean my crap before I use it. <laughs> so we we'll either do a whole video on just this stuff or just throw them in here and there. So again, we got one of these for me and one for you guys for a giveaway. And this one we just got one of because we wasn't real sure about it. Um, and this was the most expensive thing on the list. This was $2. Actually, the rolling papers was the most expensive at $2.75. Um, can't really see the picture. This is a twisty glass blunt. Get her popped out of the box here. Some people said they like these. Some people said that they didn't work real good. So I figure we'll see. Um, now again on this one, I could only get this color. Um, get a little cleaning tool or something. For the dollar price, I could only get this color and this design. They had some different tips, but those got pricier. So if I remember correctly, I believe what you did was took this off, put weed in there, and then screw this corkscrew it back down in. And then as you smoke it, you just corkscrew it up and it pushes the weed up and the ash out. So I wasn't real thrilled about this piece. They had one, or the mouthpiece. They had one that was a little bit more tapered. Um, and they had another one that was metal, I believe. Those was coming in at like five bucks. I couldn't get it for the dollar prize or the $2 prize. So like I said, I went for the cheapest um, I figured color didn't really matter. We wasn't trying to, we just seen how good the quality of the stuff was. Um, the only thing I'm really disappointed with, like I said, are the, the papers. Um, you know, for $275 and a dollar to ship, so $375 for a pack of papers is kind of high. Um, these seem like good quality. I mean, everything is decent thick plastic, nothing thin on there. Um, same thing with that. The socks are decent quality. Um, these, I knew what they was going to be. I knew they wasn't going to be the greatest for a buck a piece, and they're not. You know, it's just a little simple grinder in there. Um, it doesn't look like it's probably going to be smell-proof. It doesn't look like that fits tight enough, and it's got those weird cuts there. I don't know what the hell that is about. But I figured that'd be something good to take camping. Um, maybe to a festival or something like that, a concert. Something you didn't want to take your nice piece and uh, worry about losing it. Anything like that. So, like I said, just a little travel piece and a pinch is what I basically figured that one for. Um, and these, like I said, with that little... You can kind of see it down there. This is folded over, so right here you're getting that little seam that you're never going to get it cleaned out of. Um, that makes sense. So, like I said, we will do another video. Um try all this stuff out or maybe just try one in a, in a smoke video here and there but like I said there's some cheap stuff on wish if you guys are looking to you know get some different stuff and try some different stuff out it's a nice place to go you're really not going to probably get the best quality <coughs> you know this is decent quality but I'm sure if you spent 20 bucks it would be a lot better quality somewhere else <coughs> But this is going to function about the same as the other one. So if this functions decent and I really, really like it and I want to step it up, then I can spend 20 bucks. If I don't like it, it sucks and the ash doesn't clear out like it should. Um, if it heats up too much trying to smoke that whole thing, 
um, then there's no sense in wasting 20 bucks on wine. Something like this, I don't see where you'd want to waste 15 bucks. Um, this is just really almost a throwaway thing, really. I mean, for a buck. You can stick this in your glove box. You have it for emergencies. You've always Nowadays, we've always got a water bottle, Sprite bottle, some kind of pop bottle you can screw this thing onto and puff and go as you need. You don't have to worry about carrying no papers, no nothing. The bowl's, like I said, already on the down stem there. So it's a nice little all-in-one handy thing to just throw somewhere and have it for a pinch. I thought, like I said, this would be good for camping, too. I could take a pipe. It was a buck. Um, and just smoke out of my water bottle. And if I lose it, I'm out of dollar. I'm not going to be sad. So that's it, guys. Let me know what you guys think of the wish haul. Uh, we will do another wish haul soon. Probably step it up a little bit and probably do you know, some better quality items for sure. Um, like I said, this was just a cheap, cheap. I just basically picked everything I could find under two bucks or three bucks. I tried to keep everything around a dollar, if you can notice. Like I said, this was the two dollars, a dollar, a dollar fifty or something like that, a dollar for these, a dollar for these, a dollar. Pretty much everything was a dollar. So that's going to be it, guys. If you haven't subscribed, make sure you do that. Um, and tell me what you guys liked. We will have, like I said, a review tomorrow. Probably going to be this layer cake. Um, because I'm starting to run low on it and I want to get a review out before I finish it off. <coughs> we also have two new strains to show. Um, from somewhere different. We haven't been for a while. Um, so be on the lookout for that tomorrow. And I think that's going to be it, guys. Until next time, um, I'll catch you guys down there in the comments here in a little bit. And keep on token, my friends.